Hello everyone, this is Levi Sheridan. Today I'm making a video about this three-axis gimbal quadcopter test stand I designed and made for uh, a drone control class that I am in. Um, this is a three-axis gimbal, uh, meaning it allows the quadcopter to rotate in uh, the three um, coordinate axes, a yaw, pitch, and roll. And this is very useful because it allows us to test control algorithms uh, that otherwise would be dangerous or hazardous to test, meaning if a control algorithm isn't properly tuned for the, the quadcopter, it won't fly stably, meaning it could fly into a person or, or a thing or break the quadcopter. So uh, what this gimbal does is it constrains three of the six degrees of freedom um, being the translation uh, degrees of freedom. So it can't move uh, throughout space, but it can rotate uh, around a center uh, point somewhere in the quadcopter uh, in all three of the coordinate axes. Um, it's completely 3D printed apart from the screws and bearings that hold it together. Uh, so there are really, I think, four 3D printed parts. Uh, yes, four. Uh, so the base, which has one radial bearing and a thrust bearing here, uh, and that helps with uh, any uh, dynamic loading on it. It kind of distributes the force and still allows it to spin very smoothly. Uh, and then there's this, the biggest piece is the outer cage here, and it has two bearings, press fit, uh, one there and one on this side, uh, into it. And then there's the inner cage or the inner ring here, which also has two bearings press fit into it. And then there's the quadcopter control, or I'm sorry, the quadcopter uh, mount where the quadcopter is connected to. Uh, and that's pretty much everything. Uh, it's not perfectly balanced right now, but it still is uh, very smooth in all of the axes. And I think it will work really well for uh, the purposes I designed it for. Uh, but that's pretty much it. Uh, thank you for watching, and I hope you have a great day.